What's up? What's up? What's up? What's happening? What's going on? Welcome to the Drinks and Discussion Podcast. I am your host, King Bach, along with my co-host, Miss V. What's happening? What's happening? What's we up? live today, man. We having a good time today. We look, man. I, I, I got my shit together today. Whew. Can't tell me nothing, man. Never. Doing my thing. Never. Nope. You sure can't. You sure <laughs> <Never>. can't. <laughs> But no, nah, all, all serious though, all seriousness though. Uh, but how was your weekend? My weekend was great. Okay, weekend okay, was okay. lit. All right, what you do this weekend? T- tell, me, tell, me, tell me about it. Tell me about um, it. I went out Friday. Mm-hmm. Went to um, Article. Mm-hmm. That was everything. It was amazing. Mm-hmm. Um, who, you, who was you at Article to see? I was there to see everybody, really. I was glad to see Marcus Anderson. I was glad to see Black Violin. I was really here for Ari. I sang every one of her songs because I know them all. Love her. Can we get and, a sample? No. <laughs> and um, also, uh, of course, Jill. Mm. Jilly from Philly. I heard, Jill, I heard Jill Scott had the girls out. She had the girls out? I mean, yes, but I, that was for you. So you missed that. I did miss that. <laughs> yeah, you I did. I heard she had the girls out, though. You did. You know what? I didn't miss it because I saw it on Instagram. Look, you can... Everybody was If they was don't live. publicize it on TV... It was live. Everybody it was, was live. I was, <laughs> it was all live. Those folks. I was like, she, oh. She had them girls out. I'm just, my God. Mm. She could take me whenever. Okay, moving on. But look, Jill Scott is bad. Don't <laughs> act like that. Don't act like that. I'm not acting like anything. I'm just saying. Don't act like that. I'm all right, so a couple orders of business to get into before we start the podcast. One thing. Um, make sure y'all subscribe to our YouTube channel. That's where we're going to be posting our videos every Friday. Make sure you follow us on all streaming platforms. Uh, we post the audio every Wednesday. So just make sure y'all keep current with us. Um, of course, we have the Facebook page um, Friday for the Facebook page as well. We will post... Uh, Friday for YouTube. Yeah, Friday for Facebook, Friday for YouTube. We'll post the videos. Um, also on our Facebook page, we will post the links on Wednesday for the uh for the audio of the podcast so y'all be able to catch the everything make sure y'all stay up to date y'all ain't even got to try just go ahead and follow the page and it's gonna pop up right on your timeline like follow share yeah oh share share it with everybody share it with share. everybody share it with everybody all right so um so this this week again vita's gonna go ahead and do her thing man so i'm i'm i'm, I'm chilling man i'm gonna let her do her thing so this week we are going to talk about Texting versus calling, um, because I feel like as millennials, we have strayed away from actually picking up the phone and calling people. Nobody wants to call anymore. Everybody wants to text. Call me. I thought you weren't serious. <laughs> <this week. laughs> we already talked about this. You know I got to do it at least once, we man. We already talked about this. We said no more. Uh, um, <laughs> God, I mean, never have, have any fun. People have spoken. Um, so... Um, what's your, how do you like to communicate? Let me what tell you, you this. Let me tell you this right now. I'm old school. I'm old school, man. I like, um, I like calling. Like, I'm from the era of you go to the movie theater, you go to the mall, you run into a chick, you get her number, you know. And you had, look, you had to have game to get the number, yo. I had no game. I don't know why girls gave me their number. <laughs> I have no idea why. Bro, yo, See, if you, if you met me between the ages of 13 and 18, I I'm had sorry. zero game. I'm sorry. Between middle school and high school, I had no game. None whatsoever. I was like nervous, awkward, unconfident. Like it was a lot of shit going on with me. But um, but no, all seriousness, no, um, yeah, calling. Like, um, I liked it. I liked it. I understand texting is convenient, especially if I'm at work. I'm not gonna call you, you know, at of work course. or nothing like I mean that. that. I mean that's understandable. Yeah. Nobody's expecting you to pick up the phone during your yeah. Business but look, if you have a serious conversation to talk to me about, don't fucking text me. I'll cuss your ass out. Don't text me. Call me. Call me. Absolutely. Call, it's FaceTime. You ain't even got to come over to have a face-to-face conversation no more. It's FaceTime. FaceTime. Face-to-face is still better, though. But fa- FaceTime, will we can, we can, yeah. we can oh, do that. And then, um, and then with texting, people try to interpret your tone. I, oh, my God. I just dealt with that. I just dealt with that this week. Oh, I just us. dealt with that this week. Do tell. Do oh, tell. I, I, I tell you. I tell you. No, no, no. It, it ain't nothing like that. No, no, no. My mama thought I was yelling at her. Oh. <laughs> she Why thought, were you texting your said, mama? <laughs> we we just we look, just talking about mom, this right now. Why right? call your mama? No, 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 no. no. She <laughs> was you texting she, your mama. She was at work. I was at work. Okay. We couldn't call it each other. During work hours. Yeah, during work hours. Okay. During work hours. During work hours. So yeah, but my mama thought I was yelling at her. She calls me after I get off work. Tell me something. 
why are you mad at me? I said, what would make you think I'm mad? I felt like you was yelling at me through text message, mom. Yeah, that's what I felt like. I said, mom, got your feelings. Wasn't yelling at you. Just keeping it 100 with you. This is what I wanted you to know. She was like, oh, okay. Well, why'd you just say that? I did. I did. That, that is the problem with texting. You cannot interpret people's tone. You don't know if they're mad, sad. You don't know. You don't know. So yeah, then you no read idea. the text and you're sitting there like, I don't know how to respond because I'm not really sure how to feel. So that's why you should call people. Right. Always. So what's your what's your preferred method? I Calling. know you're I know you're a little younger. Call. <laughs> Calling. <laughs> I'm from the era where we used to stay up all night on the phone running up phone bills. Oh man. Yo. <laughs> that's where and I'm your, from. Your parents would get off that goddamn phone. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll be on that goddamn phone. But like, hey, I'm not. The phone on the pillow. I'm yes, not. exactly. Hello? It be, yeah, right. my mama be tripping. <laughs> my mama be tripping. <laughs> my mama tripping. She told me to get off the phone, but I ain't getting off the phone, though. <laughs> but I'm still here, though. Oh, my God. Back before all that texting and, man, look. I miss those days. Those I days. do. I you used miss to, it. You used to have the time when the girl was going to be at home. It wasn't no cell phone. You used to have the time when the girl was going to be at home. And then t- and then don't let her have a daddy. Oh, don't let her pops be in the house. If her pops is in the household, he, yo, uh, hello, who this? Uh, yeah, this, uh, this Baca. Uh, um, can, can, can I speak to Georgette? Georgette, don't get no phone calls from no boys. <laughs> I have hung up on parents before. <laughs> Or you get or you get the <laughs> dad mind. or you get the dad to be like um uh, be like uh so so what you want with my daughter? Uh I mean I mean we 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 friends. Oh y'all friends, what kind of friends y'all is? <laughs> and don't call late. Oh, oh my god. Mm-mm. When you when you're on the phone all night and, and somebody got to get off the phone. Oh, my mama coming. Then you got to figure out how to get back on the phone. Like you holding the phone, you you holding the phone, making sure it don't ring. You in the house turning all the ringers off. Like shh. Unplugging them shit. I used to unplug them shits. Look, we had when I was growing up, we had two phones in the house. It was one in my parents' room and then one in the living room. Right. I used to always unplug the one in my parents' room because the school used to always call. So I used to. But look, when you unplug Bad it, you children. can't unplug it all the way. Bad you gotta, you gotta unplug it just a little bit so the shit kind of hangs, so they don't notice. Like he if, if you look at it, a professional. <laughs> but phone the one in the living room, my dumb ass will unplug that shit all the way. My mom will be like, "Who unplugged the goddamn phone?" <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Luke probably did that shit, bro. <laughs> Out here trying to trying to cupcake late look, night. Look, blaming it on my little brother, man. I used to, I used to have the cordless phone. In my room. The shit used to go dead being in my room. That's how bad it used to be. I had my own cordless phone. Oh, my God. You was fancy. I think at one point, I think I had my own line. I had my own line. Oh, you you rich, rich. No, 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 no. Yeah, your like folks that. was rich, I think, rich. I think I did. For some reason, I remember that. I think your we folks had, was I had rich, my rich. Own line. Because, no, that was back in the AIM days where we were try- I was trying to be on AOL Instant Messenger all day. Oh, my mom was my trying to talk God. on the phone. I was like... Maybe I just asked for it. I don't know. That was oh a long time ago. Oh my god, yo, dial up, dial up was the shit, man. You used to hit him with the ASL, a sex and location. What's up? What's happening? So he was in the chat room. I was That's in the chat room. I was in the chat room with him. Trying to tell us ASL, right ASL. Now. ASL. Nobody won't say that. I'm regular AMD with your friends. As soon as that L said NC, yo, what up with you? Terrible. Oh my god! I, wasn't, I was not in the chat room. I was in the chat room. It was heavy. You hear me? Was not in the chat room. I was, I was chat chatting was with my friends. Oh, I was chatting with everybody. <laughs> Look, you, they had a little explorer shit that you could go and like type in like the first name of somebody. I was typing a girl's name like Ashley. All these Ashleys pop up. And it'd be like North Carolina. Yeah, let me see what she up to. What's up, Ashley? <laughs> This is 90s thirst. I don't know how to feel no, about it. I was a thirsty little nigga, y'all. <laughs> Early 2000s thirst. I don't oh, know how to man, feel about you this thirst. Oh, man, you could tell me nothing. I don't know how to feel about it. Oh, man. All right, so back to... Uh, <laughs> back to... <laughs> Back to, back we to just the, went way left. Yeah, okay, we, we did. Back, we, we did. Back, we did. Back, we really did. got really back in. in. All right, so um, so does... does uh, all right, so I guess does communication count as quality time for you? Like, is that is that what you would yes. consider quality time? Yes. Why is that? Because it is it's still time out of your schedule to ha- to make a phone call, even if it's not, even if we're not talking for an hour, or two hours. Like, because 
life is busy. You don't you don't see people every day. Like back in the day when we used to date and you see everybody at school the next day. You don't see everybody every day. So it's nice to get some sort of phone communication throughout the day. Like it's nice to hear somebody's voice even for a little while. Like we're always in our cars. We're always driving to and from work. At some point, you yeah. can you can at least, you know, send give a give a quick Quick five, ten minute well, phone call. It, it it depends. It depends oh, for me. Geez. It depends for me. No, no, no. Because if, I, if I'm riding down 40 and um, if I'm riding down 40, I got my music jumping. I mean, if you call me, I might answer. I might answer. If my music is jumping and I'm blasting it down 40 going to work, I might answer. I might answer. Nobody ain't saying call at 7 o'clock in the morning. I'm saying oh, I'm like not, on I'm your way I'm out of my home. house at 5. What? <laughs> it's 7 o'clock in the morning, you going to get caught up in all that traffic. Try to go to Raleigh. I'm out of this house at 5 in the morning. I'm definitely not calling anybody at 5 o'clock in the morning. Mm. It's still dark. So you, that, that means you ain't up? No. Mm. <laughs> so if we get are you up text at 5, not it. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm asleep. All right. So so with that, um, so with the way technology is now, um, I mean, would you prefer a phone call or FaceTime? You team iPhone. Mm. What's up with it? I, that one's hard. I personally am not a huge fan of FaceTime because I feel like I got to sit still. I'm a busybody. So if I'm at home and I'm moving, like, I feel like when I'm on FaceTime, I'm restricted. I feel like I got to sit there and be on the phone. All right. First of all, I'm going to call you bullshit on that because I FaceTimed you the other day. And you was walking was, around doing all kinds of other I stuff. I sure was. I was doing laundry. I'm trying to I talk to you. I clothes. <laughs> I'm talking to you about the podcast. And you all walking around. Your dog that came up to the FaceTime. I done FaceTime on with your that's, dog. That's why I don't like the FaceTime because I got stuff to do. Oh, I can't my leave, God. I can't sit in one place trying to FaceTime. Oh, my God. That's funny. All right. So, uh... I understand your uh, your communication concerns and do's and don'ts. Now, um, you ever been in a long distance relationship? Uh, yes. <laughs> okay. Yes. Okay. Was this recent or a long time ago? Uh, probably a little while ago. Um, definitely, definitely a while ago. But we definitely made sure that we could at least see each other. Every weekend, every other weekend, something like that. But we would talk during the week. Okay. We would call each other. We text each other during work or when we couldn't talk. Okay. But we were definitely calling each other because so, it's important to stay in touch. It's important to have that that vocal conversation. It's important to hear them because then you kind of you you get a feel for people better if you if you're talking to them. Like I think, mm -hmm. especially like in the beginning of a relationship. You need that throughout the relationship, not just the beginning. Communication is key, especially in the beginning. Especially in the beginning. Right, right, right. No, Getting I, to know people, you, you can't get to know anybody through a text message. No, you can't. You can't. That's why. I'm, that's why I'm kind of uh, uh, against online dating. Like I don't not people that do it, man. But I just you know, I rather approach a, a young lady and you know try to you know finesse my way in there than just you know. That's the problem, though. People have gotten lazy because there is online dating, so nobody is approaching people. Yeah, man. They hitting everybody with the same message. <laughs> I've seen niggas do it. Niggas are fucking terrible. Niggas that's doing that shit, you fucking terrible. Horrible. Horrible people. Bro, you gotta... Like, even even when even when I was on um, dating apps or whatever, whatever, like, I would craft messages. Like, every, every message was crafted to... <laughs> To the to the young lady that that I found interesting, you know what I'm saying? Like he's back to his ways. I, man, look, I would he's craft. Back. Look, I would, I would, look, I would go to their page. I would read their page. If they said something like, uh, "Oh, I like, uh, oh, I'm a gamer. I like, uh, I like playing games on Xbox. I like playing Call of Duty on Xbox." I mean, you know, I might craft a message like, "Yo, Xbox ain't shit. PlayStation is where it's at. I whoop your ass on some Call of Duty." You know what I'm saying? Like, is where it's at though. You got I PlayStation? Think. Yeah. What? Yeah. You got old PlayStation, don't you? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> 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 you 
<laughs> yo, yo, girls that have PlayStations be having old PlayStation. And in the back of my mind, so look, in the back of my mind, if I ever go to a, if I ever go to a young lady's y'all house, play with it. Y'all no, listen, play listen, it. listen, listen. If I ever go to a young lady's house, right, and she has a uh, old PlayStation, I, in the back of my mind, I'd be like, oh, she took it back from the last nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I'm no comment. No comment. Oh man. No comment. Oh man. So all right. So speaking of, since we've been talking about texting for a while, right? You remember T Nine? Yes. Oh, yes. Yo, T Nine was the <laughs> shit, yo. T Nine. Look, I cheated on so many tests in high school with T because you didn't have to look at the phone. You had to look at the phone one time, make sure you was on the right contact, and. Sh- Ba, 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 ba. I only had to look at the phone. I'm texting all the answers to my nigga. Yo, yo, AJ, you got the answer? Yeah, I got the answer, nigga. <laughs> oh, so yeah. you were giving the answers, not receiving? I mean, I was smart. I've always been smart. I'm a smart young man. Very smart young man. Okay. Yeah. T9. <laughs> T9. All right. all right, so uh, it was a T9, and then it went to uh, Android got the swipe first, and yeah. then iPhone just got it now. Yeah. Um... Oh, you remember when you had to pay for your text messages? Yes. Oh, my God. I that shit up. was trash, yo. <laughs> oh, my. I used to run my mama's phone bill all the way up. I, I ran up my sister's phone bill. She said, who are you talking to? Because <laughs> you used to have to delete the text messages after when you get the phone back. Oh, my. Yeah, I didn't have a cell phone. When I was younger, I didn't have a cell phone for the longest. Like, I had went to the corner store one time and bought me one, and my parents found it and took it away from me. <laughs> I, I, I had put like eighty dollars on that phone, yo. Yeah, I was, I was trying to get it. I was trying to get it. I think I had a cell phone in like maybe sixth grade, seventh, eight, something. I had one in middle school, but it's because I was a cheerleader, so I needed. Oh, you all I needed. Young. I was like sixth grade. I said, "Oh yeah, she Why is kind of young." We are not that far apart. Far enough. Anyway, <laughs> I needed it because I was doing after school activities. But the text messages were like ten cent a text. But when you send, when you send a couple, you like, oh, that was just fifty cent. I can, I can pay that little fifty cent, yeah, and then right. fifty cent turns into like fifty dollars, and you're like, dang, y'all had a whole conversation with right, somebody. right. <laughs> Who text was message, I talking to? text message. Who was I talking oh, to? Oh, you know what? You know what? What else was cool? The uh, if you had was it all tell? If you had all tell, it was free after eight. Anybody else, it was free after nine. So you, I had all tell. Sprint was free after seven. Th- that was later on. That didn't come till later on. That didn't, that didn't, Sprint didn't do that till later on. Because they was free after nine for a while. Well, this must have been my generation. This must have been when I came. Yeah, here. yeah, yeah. Because you was, you was a little behind right. us. You was a little behind no, us. No, we, I was in the country, so we had U.S. Cellular. What y'all know? What y'all know? Uh, don't nobody know nothing about U.S. Cellular. <laughs> U.S. Cellular. Nah, we, it's still working the country. <laughs> nothing else. Yeah, nothing else. <laughs> nothing else. else. Nothing else. I go to see my grandma. My phone be like, nah, nigga. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> nah. My phone, it used to, um, because where I'm from, there's a lot of them around, like. Um, where you from? Where I'm from, <laughs> there's a lot of them. So my phone would think I was in a whole different state when I went back home. So, 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 so how are we going to take this podcast to the next level if you're not going to indulge information about yourself? <laughs> I'm, up here, I'm, 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 I'm up here sharing all my, uh-huh. all my, all my inner work is of me. And, I am uh, from Eastern North Carolina. That's bullshit, man. <laughs> that is where I'm from. That's a wide range of places. But you from the coast? No, I'm not from the coast. I'm from Wayne County, 919, all day. <laughs> That sounded so white. <laughs> Don't come for me. I okay? You, I bet you when, when y'all laugh and clap and be like, ha! <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! Uh, get out! <laughs> get out! <laughs> you get out. Oh, okay. man. Anyway, we was, we was 10 cents for the text messages. <laughs> Free nights and weekends. I'm tired of you. <laughs> Of you already. Oh man, but look, they changed the game though when they started making they started making nights and weekends unlimited. Like when the weekends was unlimited, because that's when that's when that's when everything popped off. Everything popped off on the weekend. Talk to you, talk to your little your, your little uh your little, your little boo bay on the weekend. Y'all chatting it up. Oh yeah, I'm gonna meet you at the mall. Catch the city bus, I'm gonna meet you at the mall. We ain't had no city buses. Mm-mm. So you ain't I'm, never got on a city bus? Never. I've never been on a city bus. Are you serious? I'm so serious. Even when I met you, you never got on a city bus? No, because I was riding the school bus, remember? 
You was off campus a lot. Yo, she fan, She went to a fancy school. Yeah. You was you was off off that campus a lot. Were you driving off the campus every time? No, I wasn't driving. I would be picked up, or I. I don't know how we got there. We always got somewhere, but she, I never took she the fancy city bus. as hell, man. We like, always she, she got bougie. where we needed to go. I'm not bougie. <laughs> I'm not I bougie. Not bougie. <laughs> <laughs> I am not. Oh my god! All right, so has uh, <laughs> have you? So, so your parents picked up the phone like in the middle of a conversation you was having with a boy one time. Yes. Y'all talking yes. about some nasty stuff. No. Oh. <laughs> Never. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Never. You got, but you also got to remember, I left the house early. Like yeah. I left the house in my early teens. So yeah. It was her, never. her high school had a campus. She stayed in a dorm room. <laughs> anyway, so I left the house early. So that I wasn't. I don't think I was really dating, dating before I left. I don't think I started dating until I left. Mm. So there was never a time that she would pick up and there would be anything crazy going on. But she would, but my mom would just pick up just because she knew it was two o'clock in the morning. She knew I was on the phone because <laughs> we would be, we were on completely different sides of the house. Like she was on one side and I was Bougie. on the other side. <laughs> I was on the other side of the house and she, if she woke up in the middle of the night, she would, um, she would just pick up the phone and see if I'm still on the phone. She, she pick up the phone. She'd be like, Vita, <laughs> oh my you God. on the phone? <laughs> Yes. <laughs> oh my God. Everybody be quiet. I'm like, shh, don't say nothing. <laughs> right, right. I don't know why don't people get quiet. She knows somebody on the other end of the phone. <sighs> and and I used to get caught because the bathroom was in my room. So the only way to get to the bathroom, you had to go through my room. Oh man. So I would hear her walk out of her room, and I'd be like, shh, my mama coming. Oh my. <laughs> and God. put the phone under the pillow and act like I was asleep. <laughs> and so she left. <laughs> <laughs> Time. All right, so, so speaking of that, three way call it. Yo, oh. you talk about three way call it first because I got a motherfucking story for you, and cameraman is included in it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> this, this about to be good. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Stop. Okay, okay. Three way calling. I, I never had any trouble with three way calling because when I call th- people on three way, I let them know. That they were on three way. Mm. Like I was, I was never messy. I was never like I'm gonna call such and such on three way, and I'm gonna say this, and I'm gonna say that. And you don't say nothing. <laughs> Nigga, come up with a whole game plan. Yeah, and you don't say nothing. Okay, shh, I'm gonna call. I, I've never done that. I've had that done to me before, but I've never done that. Most of the time, if I was calling people on three way, it was because I wanted to talk to both of them. So I was like, listen, I'm gonna call such and such. We about to like. Tying up, oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, up your mama phone line. Yeah, yeah. Tying up your mama phone line, man. Yeah, I got in trouble T- for that. Tied up your mama phone. <laughs> I got in trouble. My I've been waiting for a call busy. all day. The the <laughs> line busy. The, the, the man Nobody supposed to come out here for the internet all day. <laughs> your ass on the phone. Absolutely. Hey. Oh it is my what it god. Is. <laughs> all right. So let me tell you about this. Let me tell you about this. Cause I divulge stuff about myself. I want to take this podcast to the next level. So let me divulge the uh, the I'm story a good of. Child. Hold I on. Don't know what you're talking about. Hold on. Wait. 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 I'm gonna divulge the uh, the story of how I lost my virginity and three ways included in this. Yes, this is a deep dive within me. Wait. 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 You lost your virginity on three ways? <laughs> oh my God! I did not say that. I literally did not say that. Yo. <laughs> Women taking stuff and running with it. You heard what you wanted to hear. Oh, okay. No, what I, I said you. was Let me tell you a story three about way, how I lost my a three way call. Was included. A three way call was involved. Okay. All right. So, we boom. Ready? June 30th, my 14th birthday, right? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, my cameraman, my cameraman. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I hope the children ain't listening. <laughs> <laughs> so, look. Good influence. So, look. My cameraman's walking away right now because he know what I'm about to say. Oh. June 30th, my 14th do, do birthday, right? right here? <laughs> <laughs> do, do you want to sit right here? <laughs> I'll switch with you. I'll switch with you. June 30th, my 14th birthday, man. Um, man, uh, my cameraman gets me a job at Tropical Smoothie at South Point, right? He, he, was, he was the man over there. He was like, yo, you want a job? I said, yeah. Gets me the job over there. I'm happy. I got the job. Cool. Yeah. This is a lot. Yeah. This is a lot. Yeah, my work is permitting and everything. Okay. Yeah, okay. I was balling. So, uh, my cameraman thought he was a speed racer, right? So, we in our homeboy's car, right? 
the Ford Focus, when they first came out. <laughs> so we go to the parking lot. We see this other guy in the Ford Focus. He's a professional racer. His shit souped up, NOS in the system and everything, right? He pull up next to, next to my cameraman. <laughs> Yo, what up? Trying to race? <laughs> We, yeah, yeah, yeah. This nigga thought he was speed racing. So, <laughs> the, the gear shift, it wasn't a stick. It was one and two. One and two. This nigga riding down the street. Womp, 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 womp. <laughs> so, needless to say, the, the person we were racing against dusted us, right? So, he pulls off in this apartment complex, right? So... <laughs> My cameraman didn't slow down in time, hits the median, breaks the axle in our homeboy's car, right? So we like all fucked up for the day, right? Oh my god. It was it was it was terrible. It was terrible. But before that, before that, <laughs> before the race happened, um, we went to uh <laughs> we he took me to this house. <laughs> to this young lady. <laughs> to this young lady to lose my virginity. <laughs> To lose my virginity, right? So, yeah, right. So he took me to this house, right? So I go upstairs, and I, I I I know of the young lady, but I don't know the young lady. So uh, I go upstairs, and she was like, yeah. She already knew what it was. She already was like, yo, I'm going to get it popping. So she already knew what it was. She takes me upstairs or whatever, right? I walk into her bedroom. She ain't got no door on her bedroom. She got them curtain. <laughs> Like, oh, I looked back at my camera, man. I said, bro, why she got a curtain on her bedroom door? He was like, yeah, mama took it off because you kept slamming the damn door. <laughs> this is a lot. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. Let me let me unpack. So so once we get, so, so you know, I did my thing, and it was the, <laughs> Was that a moment of silence? I, I I I I didn't see the hype in it then. Oh, I see the hype in it now. Oh, but man. I didn't see the hype in it then. Oh, so no uh, reforms. What's going on here? Yeah. So uh, <laughs> I didn't see the hype in it then. I, I know the hype in it now. But I, it was just it it was an interesting experience. I will say that it was an interesting experience. It was a lot going on in that house. Where, so what, most wait, of which I cannot. The three, do, where's the three way call? It's, it's coming. Oh. It's coming. It's coming. <laughs> so two weeks later. Two weeks later. I get a phone call from the young lady. Don't know how she got my phone number. She called my house, right? My mama answered the phone, so I'm thinking it's one of my boys. She was like, Baka, I found for you. So I said, okay, shit. Sure. Hello? She was like, um, Baka, I'm pregnant. I said, yo. <laughs> Nigga, my legs got weak. I said, oh, oh, shit. I said, are you sure? Now I'm thinking like, damn, I used a condom. Did it rip? Like. I was fucking freaking out, man. Woo. And then I hear some snickering in the fucking background. <laughs> fucking cameraman. <laughs> fucking cameraman. <laughs> you got him. You got, got him. <laughs> terrible. Terrible <laughs> friends growing up. I had some terrible friends growing up, man. Terrible, man. <laughs> oh, y'all are terrible. Oh, my God. Oh, that's funny, though. That's funny. That was good. That was good. I like it. I like oh, that. my God. They were so terrible, man. I was 14 out of my damn mind, bro. I thought I had a whole kid on and the way. that's what you get. And that's why you shouldn't be out here engaging in shenanigans at 14 with people you don't even know. You say you ain't even know her. You went I did. The house. Look. <laughs> it's a lot happening here. All right. So, guys, comment under the, under the, under the uh, Facebook and YouTube video. Did you know... Like, thoroughly know the first girl you had sex with. I need to know because I can't be the only brother out here. I can't be. I can't be. I can't. It's impossible. It's impossible. This is back in the day, throwback thotting. The throwback thotting. <laughs> throwback thotting. Well, I, I wouldn't even <laughs> consider it thotting because it was losing my virginity. Like, yo, God, all right, so girls' virginity is precious. They be like, oh, I'm going to save it for somebody special. God, we trying to throw that shit to you. Just catch this motherfucker, yo. <laughs> We try to we try to throw all that shit. Oh, Get rid geez. of this. Oh, Tired of my boys. Right now. Tired of my boys picking on me, man. <laughs> so y'all just be setting each other up. I don't know. I feel like this is separate conversation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but this thank, is a lot. But, but but thank you for letting me share that with you guys. I I appreciate it. That was good. <laughs> that was that was. Hmm, oh that's a my lot. god. 
<laughs> Yo, he is still together. he is still, still weak. He is still weak. Um, so are are there any benefits of three way calling other than other than for your boy to get you? That was good. <laughs> um, talking stuff out like stuff that I don't know. Talk about stuff that happened in school. Like I said, three way for me was a party. I got all my friends. We we on the phone together, talking, laughing, joking. That's what three way was for me. I don't know what everybody else was doing with three way. Mm. If you gonna get I mean, in trouble for it, let it I be mean, worth I mean, I, I actually grew up in the era, era before three way where we had the we had the actual party line like you used to dial in, and we yeah. had the actual party line like That's cats had their yeah cats had the cassette players booming in the in the in the in the joint. It was like a whole it was like a whole party. No, you I know how they do that. like the Instagram parties now, like the Instagram live parties. Like DJs will be, you would go to different DJs lives or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Now, we used to do fun. that. Like we that. used to do that with the party phone. That's what's up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I that. that was not in my area. Yeah, I know, I know. I told you, man. That 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 we that 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 that, far apart. that. But that little bit of time, man. That little bit of time. It's essential stuff that you miss, man. I didn't miss anything. Oh no, my god. Didn't miss anything. All right, so um, so. I know we mentioned it earlier, but um, when you text important combos, um, do you feel like sometimes miscommunication happens? Every time. <laughs> Every time. I don't want to text you anything important. And if I'm texting you and I'm like, okay, this is about to be an important conversation, and you're texting me right back and we're not at work, I'm going to call you. Mm. And I expect you to answer. Like, if you can text back, you can probably call if you're not at work. You can probably call. Well, okay, it's 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 a uh, it's a thin line right there because I'll be busy. I'll be busy when I'm not at work. So, but you too busy to have an important conversation. If somebody feels like this conversation is important to me, we need to talk. Okay, so I tell you what: if somebody were to text me at six o'clock and was like, "Yo, I gotta have an important conversation with you," and I text them back and say, "Okay," and they call me right now, I can't. I'm doing shit. Well, you should say that when, instead of saying, okay. If somebody texts you at 6 o'clock and be like, hey, we're going to have it. I need to have an important conversation with you. You okay. say, okay, give me a minute. Okay. okay. All I'm, right. I'll I'm give you that. I'm doing something right now. I'll give you a call when I'm done. But you know what? You know what? You can't text a female that. You can't. You, I, I'm going to tell you because the response is going to be, uh, oh, so I guess I'm not important enough for you to stop whatever Who it is. Who you be talking to that be like this? <laughs> That's, that's the first problem. Don't talk to nobody that be. That's unnecessary. So if somebody if somebody texts you and is like, "Hey, I need to talk to you," then you let them know, "Hey, I'm doing something," and give a time. Give me thirty okay. minutes. Give me an hour. Hey, I'm over here. I'll be done. You know, give a time. Okay, and I can respect that. I can give respect a, that. And call at the end of the time too. Because y'all give a time just to shut us up. <laughs> y'all be like, oh, I'll call you in 30 minutes. And 30 minutes later, we still looking at the phone like... Two hours later, you still looking like, at the Sprint phone. I Sprint cut me off. Like, you know Sprint good for cutting you off. <laughs> you, you paid your bill? <laughs> yes, I paid. <laughs> I be like, Is, did, I, did I get cut off? I ain't got no signal. I'm over here, like, checking signal. Like, what? Re- refreshing iPhone text messages? Yeah, refreshing, <laughs> refreshing text messages? I don't know. I don't know what kind of iPhone she got. She got that bootleg <laughs> iPhone, refreshing text messages. Refreshing text messages. I'm trying to see what's going on. Oh, my God. And if I text you again, it's going to be a problem. So so would you say face-to-face is always better? Face-to-face is always better. Always. If you can if you can be face-to-face, that's the best way. Okay, like, so, to, so why? To talk, to talk things out. If you need to talk something out, face-to-face is better. Okay, so why 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 do why do girls not all girls, but why do girls do this? Be like, oh yeah, we need to talk about some stuff, right? So you set up a time, all right, look, boom, we're gonna meet face to face, we going to my place, your place, Starbucks, McDonald's, wherever, you know, to talk face to face or whatever. You get face to face. So what you wanna say? Mama, you said you had to talk to me. Why I gotta start off the conversation? Again, the problem is he talking to <laughs> her. And that's why. No, but this could be a civilized one, and it's still it's still be the same thing. I just it just blows my mind that that I haven't done that. You haven't done that. I don't think so. Hmm. If I have, correct me. But I don't think I have. Fellas, if <laughs> if she's done, thank you. If she's done that to you, put it in the comments <laughs> below. Uh uh-uh. uh send me a DM. Nope. <laughs> 
put it right in the comments. Put it right in the comments. I want I want some random dude to be like, yeah, she did it to me. I'm like, oh, oh, I'm, ri like, I'm riding with you all the way, dog. Sorry to this man. <laughs> don't know this man. I feel sorry for him. I feel sorry for this man. If this oh, man was man. walking down the street, I wouldn't know who he was. Oh, man. <laughs> That's funny. All right. Um. So, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. I don't know what I'm going to do with you either. I don't know what to do with you in these stories. Oh, my God. I am not that bad. Terrible. I am not that bad. Terrible. Terrible um, child. All right, so one of my pet peeves with uh, one of my pet peeves with texting is um, improper grammar. I hate that with a with a hate. passion. Know the hate. difference between there, there, and there. Please know the difference because it's a difference. It's just, your and your, you are and your. Are you, two. your, and you are. Know the difference please, because if please. you text me, your and you mean. U apostrophe R E, not responding to your text message. I promise you, I'm not too correct. I can't corrected. stand that. That makes me cringe every time. Like, I be wanting to throw my phone, you know. If I, I be, just started talking to somebody, I'd be like, "Oh, he cool." But da, 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 da. the and nigga he, can't and spell. He say your. Oh, it's a wrap. It's done. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. I can't. You cannot come back from that. Like, I pride myself in having an, an extensive vocabulary, but on top of that, I also know how to spell. And then, on top of that, there's autocorrect. Right. Oh, and people people will go on top of autocorrect thinking that they know how to spell something. Look, if there's a red line, you, barely you made don't it know out how of, to spell. You barely made it out of <laughs> high school <laughs> English class. And you, man, look. I, you don't know what? use big words that you don't know how to spell. Google them. You, you can Google. Not, not even Google. Dictation. Dictation. It's a dictation button on your phone. If and you, you can say speak, the word. If you can't speak, you can't. Yeah, y'all country it's niggas can't gonna speak. It's not going to dictate it for you. I've had people that, that, that talk to text, and it's, it's, it's worse. I'm like, you know what? Just have you, don't have text you, me. Have you ever tried? You, you're pretty country. Have you ever tried to talk to text? Don't come for me. I'm not country. <laughs> I'm very proper. I speak very proper air. grammar. Proper air. Proper <laughs> Um... Anywho, no, I don't do talk to text because I, if I'm talking, I'm calling. I'm not texting. But, um, yes, if you, if you cannot use proper grammar, like, I'm not talking about, like, punctuation. I'm not talking about that. Yeah, it's I'm not talking an essay. About, it's a text message. I'm talking about just simple, like, you and you are, that, or a and an. Do y'all know when to use an? Like, it. <sighs> It all right. is so much all right, better Professor if you B. just all right, use a. Wait, 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 wait. Let, let's no, really... just use a all the time. Just use that one because it's it's more likely that that's going to be the one that you need. Okay, that's, I'm done. <laughs> Those are my two. So, so I take it you you like uh, intellectual guys. I do. I like a smart man. I like him a little nerdy. I like him to be a little nerdy. <laughs> okay, how how nerdy are we talking? I like I'm trying. I'm trying to get you a date. How nerdy are we talking? <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to help you I don't out. Know how to feel about this? I'm trying to help my I friend like, out. <laughs> I like a little nerdy, like um, I don't know, just nerdy. Like I need for you, you like to talk nerdy about, with like a pro pocket protector. No, nerdy? no, 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 no. I don't want you to look nerdy. I want you to think nerdy. Okay, so you want like you want like a guy that uh that uh goes and watches Dragon Ball Z and yes, anime. Would you would you sit would, would you sit anime. down? Anime. Subs over dubs. Ooh. <laughs> Yo. Uh, Crunchy track. roll. We on, on Crunchy track. roll. Because this is this. On what? Crunchy roll. Yo, I'm finding out new shit about her every day. <laughs> I've who known, are you? What, what year? Yeah, who are you? Who are you? I, what, what year I met you? Oh, five, oh, six. Sweet. Baby Jesus. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, it had to be. It had to be after 06. So it had Maybe to be like late 07. 06, 07. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So, like that. God, so mighty. Yes. I want to talk. I want to talk anime. I want to talk Harry Potter. If you can talk about Harry Potter and like know all the books, if you can like quote and be like, "This was in book number number four, I'd be like, "Oh my gosh." Oh. Yeah, I don't know nobody like that. I'm sorry. I, I mean, I don't watch Harry Potter. I've never watched an I entire movie. I don't movie. like the movies. I read the books four times though. 
So, all right. So let me, let me that out there. Let me say this. So, <laughs> like, I've never watched, like, Harry Potter. I've never watched, like, The Hobbit or anything like that. Yeah, so I never watched Lord I, of the Rings, um, but I would. But um, I was talking to this one young lady, and she made me sit down and watch. It was actually pretty dope. I watched, like, the little bit. I think it was the, I think it was the Hobbit. Okay. Yeah, the Hobbit. Yeah, mm-hmm. I think it was the Hobbit. It was actually pretty dope, man. It's actually pretty dope. I I liked it. It was like okay, now I understand like references from like Family Guy and shit like that because I like Family Guy. Like mm-hmm. I like Family Guy, American Dad, all that shit. Yeah, so. I like all of that. Boondocks. You got to be in on the Boondocks. Yo, if my cameraman be... would stop being stingy and show the art in the background, <laughs> we would be all right. Got to be in on the Boondocks. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Gotta yeah. Be in on the boondocks. Look. Boondocks, nigga. Boondocks. My dog's name is Riley. I just want to put that out there. So you got to be in. I feel like I'm Huey mixed with Riley. Like, I'm intellectual, but I'm ratchet at the same time. Like, that's that's what I feel like internalizes me. Both of them. Okay. Um, <sighs> got to be in on the Boondocks, anime, stuff like that. So, yeah, be like, yeah, give me something that ain't regular. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm just saying. That's, give me something. I'm, excuse me. Give me something that isn't regular. <laughs> give me something that is different. That was her ratchet coming out. Give me something that ain't regular. <laughs> yes, with, with the hands. With the hands. What the fuck do y'all be grabbing? <laughs> what the fuck are y'all grabbing for? Messages, ideas, <laughs> words. <laughs> y'all be y'all be grabbing files like so. I heard yep. that you were <laughs> at the bar with another bitch. Like I was like, what are you? Exactly, for. we grabbing evidence. <laughs> evidence, files, and facts. Exactly. <laughs> so that when you come that back, we can be like, oh no, because I already pulled your file. <laughs> yo, <laughs> Which your lies. Yo, yo, fellas, don't lie to women because their brains work differently. We already from knew. how our brains work. Our we brains work, our brains work in a systematic, logical stream. Are you trying to say we're illogical? No. No, 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 no. I'm not trying to say y'all illogical. Y'all, they have file maintenance. They have a button in their brain called file maintenance. And every time you tell them a fucking lie, that shit goes in the possible lie folder. <laughs> you ever had, on your computer right now, you got, <laughs> you got a folder that say random shit. <laughs> and you put random shit in that folder every time. That's what girls put. They have a random lie folder. I think this nigga lying. I think this nigga lying. So when they catch you in that shit, it's a fucking rap. Out. It's a fucking rap. Yes. My, sis- right. my sister calls me the um, receipt queen. Oh, my God. So don't lie, because I'll pull up. I'll pull out receipts. I'll screenshot. I'll be like, nah, because on Thursday at 637, you said on Friday this is where you're going to be. But I called you, and that's not where you were. So where you at? That's, that's too much. <laughs> that's too much. All right. So we, we got a little off topic. So, <laughs> boom. Back to the topic at hand. Okay. okay. All right. So speaking of which, uh, while uh, while somebody is uh, uh, courting you, um, and you know, or you guys are in a relationship, either or, would you ever double or triple text them? It depends on what you call double and triple text, because sometimes, sometimes, wait a minute, wait a minute, <laughs> wait a minute, listen to where I'm going with this. Okay, I'm listening. Because sometimes I'm texting a conversation, and I will like keep texting. I text ideas separately. So I don't consider that double, triple texting. I consider double, triple, triple texting when, like, I've said something to you and you didn't respond. And mm. then I'm like, um, so did you get my text or no? Nah? Then that's double, triple texting. That's when I'm like, um. Yeah, I got my red receipts off, so you don't never know if I get the text message or not. It'll say delivered, but it might not be delivered. No, it's always delivered. You got the text message. It's just, are you going to respond to it? <laughs> And especially if it's something important, especially if I said, like, I feel some type of way or if, like, if it's important or if I've asked you a question. Message? What was the text message you sent? No, give, give it to me. I'm, I'm going to be the guy. We, we're going to role play real quick. <laughs> oh, we're role playing? Yeah. I'm, 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 I'm out with my homies right now. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> um, what time do you think you're going to be done? Boom. <laughs> she tripping, bro. Um, so you you still out or not? <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> Are you safe? <laughs> Did you make it home safe? Yo, stop texting me. Did you fall asleep? <laughs> Are, Are you, you up? <laughs> Get out of my house. Get out of my house. Are you up? <laughs> 
She done went from she done went from where the fuck this nigga at like shit. I got that tingle. <laughs> <laughs> Where the fuck this nigga at? Shit, no. I got that tingle. Because if, if I double text you and I say, are you up? That means we about to have a talk. <laughs> no, nah, man. That means we about to have a talk. Are you up? Because I'm awake. <laughs> I'm awake and we need to talk. Wonder and I'm about, not going to wonder sleep. Wonder about your ass. Or I'm not yeah, going look, to sleep. Bro, like, I'm, bro, talking to the bros. Bro, text him back, bro. Thank text you. him back. Just let him know what you're doing. Like, hey, look. At my boy house, stay a little longer than expected. We still watching the game. We still watching the fight. We still having Y'all drinks. Y'all That's a lie. <sighs> but you know what? We don't be watching the game. The game be on. We might glance at it, but we really don't be watching the game if we with the boys, like, for real, for real, getting ready to go out. That ain't part you lying about. What, what part were we lying about? You went with the boys. <laughs> oh, shit. I be with the boys. Like, I, don't, I don't know what the fuck you talking about. Boys I be, I be where I say I'm going to be. If yeah, I'm gonna be, be somewhere, where you say you're gonna be. if I'm gonna be somewhere, and I say I'm gonna be somewhere, best believe I'm gonna be there. I might not let you know when I leave, but I'm gonna be there and have receipts too, literal receipts. Boom, I was at box car. Boom, they they go to the receipt right there. Mm-hmm. Twelve fifty-five. That's when I cashed out my tab. Who were you at box car with? Myself. I ain't gotta go nowhere with nobody. You on that box car by yourself? Shit. <laughs> you. You, you know. You know. I know half a dumb. You do. Yeah, you're right, you. right. I can go to boxcar by myself, but I can link up with some people out there. Right. Who are you linking up with at the boxcar? It could be anybody. Mm-hmm. It could be anybody. Mm-hmm. Lies. See, mm-hmm. look. See, she's trying to come for me already. Already. I'm kidding. He might not be lying. But yeah, know. but <laughs> sis, I'm going to talk to the ladies real quick. Sis. Don't talk to them. I'll talk to them. No, no, no. I'm talking to them. Sis. I'll tell you what. That's, that's what y'all call each other, right? I guess. Sis. sis. <laughs> Sis, let me let me let me fill you in right quick. Don't double text your dude. Like I'm 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 just gonna be honest with you. We don't like it, you know, because we feel pressured. Don't listen to what she's saying right here. We feel pressured. Don't make us feel pressured. Let us get the opportunity to respond. Now, if it's an ongoing thing, your nigga ain't texting you back every night that he says he's going out with the boys. Thank then you. Then you can double text him. But if Thank you. if it's the first time around and he's out with the fellas and he's been spending all week with you, you gotta you gotta you gotta think of his track record. You know, if his track record is good, then you know. If don't... he's consistent. Yeah. But if he's consistent, can I talk to them? Can I talk to them? Go fellas. ahead, talk to your beehive. Fellas. I'm talking to the fellas. Oh. Just text us back. That's all you have to do. You can avoid so many arguments. Just text us back. Mm. Because we, we're not double texting like in five minutes. We double texting in like 30. Mm. We're giving you 30 to 45 minutes to the text lies. back. No, we are. It's 30 to 45 minutes in your mind. We're giving you 30 to 45 minutes to text back. We just want to make sure you're okay. We just want to be like, Bay, are you drunk right now? Do you need me to pick you up? Are you going to, be, are you going to get home safely? Do you need me to help you? Are you hungry? <laughs> Do you need something? <laughs> like, we at the Yo, house, that, 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 that's how, at the house that, worried. That's how, they, worried that's, how, that's how they try to mask it. They be like, babe, you hungry? Do you need me to pick you up? Are you drunk? That Really, they think about where the fuck you at. No. <laughs> that's, what they, that's what they really no, think. Where the you fuck at, you where, at? If you at where you say you at, we good. If you're consistent and you say, then hey. I be with no other bitch. Relates I, to, baby, honestly, are you hungry? Honestly, that's not. that's <laughs> never been my first thought. If I text somebody and they don't text me back, my first thought is never he with he with some other chick. My first thought is always like, oh my gosh, is he okay? Like I know he was like he was drunk driving. I need to make sure he's all right. Fellas, don't fucking drunk drive. We have Lyft and Uber now. Stop we do. fucking drunk driving. You don't driving. need to do that. And you like, have yo, your girl don't... that you can text, and yo. we will come get you. No, no, no. no. Let, let me let me let me put this out here real quick. So I was driving. Uber and Lyft this weekend. Y'all motherfuckers are stupid. Stop fucking drunk driving. You have Uber and Lyft. If you cannot afford to go out and have fun as well as the 6 or $7 Uber and Lyft to and from where you live, don't fucking go out. Or have a designated driver. One of the two. Like, stop doing that, bro, because y'all are making it unsafe for everybody on the road. Absolutely. I just want to put that out there because I'm, you know, I'm an adamant driver. I don't want nobody to hit me. I don't want to hit nobody. I don't want Absolutely. nobody to hit nobody else, you know. That's but good. yeah, that, that's, that, that, that's it, man. That's that, that, that was my little that's my little positive spill for the podcast, I pre- man. I appreciate that. That's to everybody, not just men. Mm. Women also. Women also. Women also. So I got a question. So we're talking about this double texting thing. So even if we don't double text, if I send you 
like some guys get a little a little anxious when you send too many too many sentences in one text message okay <laughs> too many sentences too many questions um but and y'all might answer you might answer it but y'all only answer that very last sentence. Like the other, the, the rest of it didn't even matter. Like, what did you do? Did you skim my text? And you just, or did you just read the last sentence? Like, I asked you a lot of things in that paragraph. I need you to answer all of them in order. Okay, so first of all, men and women's brains work differently. Guys, we cannot uh, uh, compartmentalize as women do. Like, when we... We see a task. We see the, the the task at hand. So when you send that last text message, in our minds, we're thinking, oh, she just wanted me to respond to that shit. Fuck that other shit she said. Yeah, all right, cool. Like, <laughs> like our minds are, our minds are very, as, as, as a man, our minds are very one track. Now, it takes time or certain personalities to develop that multitasking and doing other things like, or responding to all six of your questions that you asked in different text messages, you know, it, 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 that takes time. Like, how do we ask all the questions that we, we want to ask? Because number one, okay. number one, if we send it in one, in one little, one lump text message, okay. you're going to only answer to the last one. Okay. Then if we send one question at a time, you're going to start responding all together. You might respond to the first question. You mm-hmm. might respond to the second question. But by the time we get to the third question, you, you're, you've stopped responding. Okay, so... Mm-hmm. So how do we get our I can't questions speak, answered? I, I can't, how do we get them answered? I, I can't speak for niggas like that. Mm-hmm. Because, all right, so put me in a scenario. Put me okay. in a scenario real quick. You send the first text message. Okay. Hey, what's up? What you doing? Hey, shit, with the boys. What's up? Um, uh, I don't know. What y'all getting into? Not shit, watching the game, you know, about to go out to Boxcar. Okay, what time do you think you're going to go to Boxcar? What time do uh, you think you're going to be back? <laughs> How long? See, look, you just double text the truth text. No, this is one text message. This is, which, All right. which question are you going to answer? F- f- finish your text message. <laughs> finish your text message. I said, what, what time are y'all heading out there? What time do you think you're going to come back? I don't know. Tony ain't said when we leaving and uh, probably oh. when they close. Oh, oh, so you're going to answer both questions. Yeah, because oh. you asked it in one, in one interval, so I have to answer both questions. Right, but we're going over the fact that y'all don't answer both questions. Oh, so you say that niggas only answer the last question like, oh, whenever they close. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay, I got now you. you I got back. you down. Now you back? Yeah, now I'm okay. back. Now, now I'm here. Yeah. Okay. Now we together. Yeah, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> but, okay, so in that instance, it don't matter what time I'm, I'm going to there. That's just an example. Yeah, right. But I understand. But to, only- to me, to me, to me, to be honest with you, I probably wouldn't have answered the first text. I probably would have answered the second one where, where it said, what time are you going to be back? We're probably leaving when they're closed. Because I don't know. At this point, I told you I was with the boys. So nine times out of ten, I'm not driving. So if I'm not driving, then I'm going to head this is out. such a specific example. But right, right, we right. It's a, send, if I was to send more than that, you would only answer the last question because that's what y'all do. Oh, my God. It is what well, it is. Well, yes, I would. I, in that instance, I would answer the last question. Okay. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Got it. So, so men versus women, um, do you feel like texting, I guess you can answer for the fellas, for, and you have to answer for the fellas. I have to answer not for answer the fellas. Not answer for you because I because sometimes you go way left field and I'd be like that is not the fellas answer. You tell <laughs> See, us you want me to be a fuck boy so bad. Why are you, you are? Me? You what were. The? Oh shit! You were. You were. <laughs> I were. <laughs> I were. You were. I declare. You, you reformed. That's what you told me. So, I am a reformed fuck boy. Shit, I'm good. I'm a good guy. I'm listening. Texting or calling? Definitely calling. I've, I've always been a caller, so definitely calling. And that's the general answer? That's the general consensus among the fellas? Fellas, y'all niggas be texting. Stop fucking <laughs> Thank texting. You. Thank you. Call <laughs> your lady. Call the person Thank that you're you. interested in. Call your significant other. Call them, call them, call them, call them, call them. Call them until they get tired. They say they ain't going to get tired, but they're going to get tired of you calling their ass. Damn, boy, this boy call me all the fuck out. What you want, boy? That's if we don't like you. Then we tie to you calling. Is, oh, is that is is like that? Yeah. If I like you, I want you to call me. I'd be like, oh my god, she calling me again. Yo, somebody please slide in her DMs phone. with some plans. 
<laughs> Hit her with the what you doing. Slide in her DMs with her plans. Take her on a date. Bro, matter of fact, message the podcast. Message D&D podcast, right? Me- message the podcast. Are you vetting this? I- I- I'm going I'm to vet you, fellas. Message the D&D podcast. Slide <laughs> in the DMs. He's going to vet your plans. Right, right. No, 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 no. Slide in the DMs, and bro. I will give you plans. I will, I will, I will put you ahead of the curve if and you set the give plans, you plans up. I don't want it. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> you ain't gonna know. You ain't gonna know. You ain't gonna no, know. Cause then you no, gotta yeah. give them plans for the second day. No, no. You ain't gonna know. You ain't gonna know. Cause I'm gonna hit you with the. Oh yeah, I got a homeboy that want to take you out. He saw I can you. read the podcast stuff. Don't work. Slot. <laughs> Come to my DM, nigga. Pause. Pause. <laughs> Pause. Come to my DM, nigga. You ain't going no. I'm going to I, I forgot I set this shit up on your phone today. Pause. Come to, bro, message me. If you like her. Message you, the podcast. No, if you like her, message me. I'll put you on, my nigga. Just don't be no ugly because she like cute guys. She like she like pretty cute nerdy guys. So look, slide in the. You doing good. You doing good. Yeah, right. See, I, I know what you like, bro. I know what you like. Look, let's let me handle it. I'm trying to get you a date. Look, slide in the DMs. But the you know thing is, he acting like I'm thirsty, like I need a date. I'm trying to get you a date. I'm no, I'm trying to get you a date. I'm not saying that you're thirsty. I'm just trying to get you a date. That's all. That's all. That's all. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to be taken out by, by, by a young man that's going to that's gonna show you a good time? That would be nice. That, I mean, that's okay. I'll, I'll accept it. Trying down, it but it's trying not necessary. It. I have stuff to do. Earlier off camera, she said, "Shit, I ain't got shit to do. I be chilling. You be going out and not inviting me." He does. He goes out all the time, and then and then on the podcast Instagram live out without me. I'm like, how are you gonna be on the podcast? I, look, I'll, be at, I'll be at the soca bar getting getting it in. She she ain't feeling. She ain't feeling. But no, all serious and no, man. Look, slide in her DMs. Oh, now they in my DMs. Slide, slide, slide <laughs> in her DMs. Confused. They don't know where to go. Slide. You got three options. You got three options. I'm going to put it right here. I'm going to put it right here. Three options. I'm going to put it right here. Three DMs first. I'm going to put it right here. No, no, no. I'm going to put it right here. You got three options. <laughs> slide in. If you want to get at her, you got three avenues you can go to. Nigga, you can't miss. You can shoot your shot three times, nigga. You can still miss. <laughs> <laughs> Airball. <laughs> oh my god. Airball just shooting and missing all over. All over the place. Anyways, but yeah, uh but somebody please slide in her DMs, take her out. He is like begging. <laughs> no, I'm not begging, but no, like I want you to come in here with a story like guess what I did this weekend? I went on a date. He took me to na 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 and na 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 and we had a bow. But I went on dates this weekend. What dates you went on? I went, to the I, just asked you earlier. I went to the concert on Friday. I went out to eat afterwards. So you had a young man with you? No, I went by myself. There ain't no fucking date. <laughs> <laughs> I went on a whole date. Yeah, yeah, last night I was at Maggiano's. It was delicious. She needs she needs the, the, the company of a male individual. And she is looking. Her eyes are wide open. Shoot your shot, bro. Shoot this your shot. a lot for me. I don't know how to feel about Shoot this. Shoot your shot, bro. Anywho. Anywho, can we go? Can we move on? Yeah, we can move on. Okay, we can move thank on. you. So the moral of the story is, um, if you're available to call, call. Don't text. We don't want that. We're yeah. not here for it. Call, call your lady. Call your significant other. We're not here for it. Call, so. call, call. That's Bro, it. it'll never, it'll never be a bad idea to call. Absolutely. It'll never be a bad idea. Hey, to call. Even if it's just five, ten minutes, we just, it just makes us feel special that you took time out of your day. To be like, hey, I just wanted to hear your voice. I'm kind of busy. I'm running in and out here and there, but um, I just I hope you had a good day. Um, I don't know anything. All right, V. I'm gonna have enough of your shenanigans. Your shenanigans? No, I'm man. I ain't to did nothing. Give me away. Who said I was available? Vita, are you available? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> right. Right. Exactly. Come with some maybe. Okay. Anyway. Give, give them their three <laughs> three choices on how to, <laughs> how to shoot shots. All right, look, we out of here, man. We, we, we getting ready to get out of here, man. Um, you can follow the podcast, D, the letter N, the letter D pod on Instagram. Um, find us on Facebook. Find us on YouTube. Um, we're dropping um, the audio every Wednesday on all streaming platforms. We're dropping the videos on YouTube and Facebook every Friday. Uh, you can follow me. At King Bach, 
KVNG, uh, pretty much on all social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Um, Jada? You can follow me on Instagram at infragile underscore phoenix. Um, that's about it for now. All right. Maybe I'll move on to other platforms at some point. At some point. So <laughs> uh, are, are, is, is all your hearts and minds clear? You did this. Vita did a good job with picking the topic for today's podcast. I am very, very proud of her. Um, I definitely want to give her a round of applause as well as an air horn. She did a very good job. Thank you. I, I let her take the reins today. Yes. And, um, Content queen. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, man... Um, but yeah, I definitely appreciate you. You are definitely showing me that you want to be here, and I definitely enjoy you being here. So. Thank you. I enjoy being here. I like it here. Absolutely, man. So, oh, um, make sure you like and subscribe on both Facebook and YouTube um, and Instagram. Um, please follow us on Instagram. Follow, um, like, share. Please share. Please share because I mean, you know, we can do it for y'all, but you know, other people want to see it too. So make sure you share with your friends and family. All right. But we out of here. Peace. Peace.